Innuendo Bingo. Today, playing the game is Thomas Schaffernacker. We're very excited. Are you excited, Thomas? Are you a bit yeah. nervous? Yeah, a little bit nervous. Yeah, I've, I've, I've never predicted such big downfalls in my life. No, it is going <laughs> to be... Uh, it's going to be a wet one, I hope. Yeah. But, you know, a lot of people have, uh, have played this game. Gerard Butler played it off of Hollywood A-List. Mm-hmm. And uh, a lot of the Radio 1 DJs have played it. Ollie Murs very much enjoys playing it. It's his favourite game, isn't it? And people now play it at home, like Aisha in Bedford, who's been on, saying... We decided to play Innuendo Bingo at a family party at the weekend. My 80-year-old nan spitting water across the room is an unforgettable moment <laughs> in my life. Your game is now infamous. That's pretty cool. Uh, worldwide and, hit. That's right. Mm. And also, uh, some people who are working in a holiday company just tweeted saying that, that the whole thing, the whole office just stops for Innuendo Bingo every Tuesday and Thursday at 1.45. <laughs> okay, so Thomas, are you about to uh, get wet? Are you ready for it? You ready? Yeah. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Let's do this. So you'll hear the clips. Obviously, you'll be putting water in your mouth. If you find the clip funny, the water will probably spill out. I wouldn't worry about the bin so much. More more his face. Let us know if you're watching. bbc.co.uk slash radio one. Let me know and I might give you a mention. At bbcr1 on Twitter. Okay, here we go. So. Hmm. Water. Oh, they're good. Mouthful there, Thomas. Very good. And we begin with Radio 4's PM. And an odd choice of discussion topic from Eddie Mayer. If there is something you haven't tried, uh, drop us an email, pm at bbc.co.uk. Now, um, Thomas Schaffernack is here to uh, talk about the, the weather. Is there anything you uh, haven't put in your mouth? <laughs> <laughs> no, Thomas oh. is absolutely fine. No, no. It's almost like he's heard it before. Is there anything you, can... you uh, haven't put in your mouth in your life? <laughs> oh! <laughs> No hands. Wow. Okay. God, you give it some force there, don't you? That's good. Some people, when they're new, they hold back. Oh. But uh, not Thomas. That's good. Right then. Spit in. <laughs> Kaylee and crew was watching Gino and Mel the other day. Um, was a little bit startled by this overexcited guest. Oh, no. alive, eh? What's happened? I just squirted myself. <laughs> 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 Mm. Yo, oh, no. alive, eh? What's happened? I just squirted myself. <laughs> <laughs> You're doing very well, both of you. Mm. I just squirted myself. <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. The accent made it for me. Mm. Okay, I would have gone at that one. But let's mm. let's try over to Test Match Special now. And the commentators start planning what they're going to do after the match. You want one of them to come back pretty quickly. Yeah, I'd be tempted to to give Stark a blow, I think. (laughs) 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 Yeah, I'd be tempted to to give Stark a blow, I think. Yep. Thank you to Oliver who emailed that one in. Give yourself 250 points. How are you finding it, Thomas? Mm -hmm. You can swallow if you want and, and refill. Completely up to you. Wherever, oh, that's better. Yeah. Okay, so now now I have to... And then more. refill. We've got oh, loads. Yeah, yeah. Oh. refill. Mm-hmm. Yeah. BBC Weathers, Thomas Schaffernacker with us on Innuendo Bingo. Staying at the ashes now, and Jonathan Agnew in the commentary box next. <laughs> Recounting some fire... <laughs> Stop weeing! <laughs> Is it just because of Aggers? Mm. Okay. Mm. He's been on before. Mm. Here's Aggers recounting... Some fond memories here. Actually, I took Jim, who's staying with us, yeah. to the top of Stathen Hill the okay. other day, and I showed him the beaver. <laughs> <laughs> That's the beautiful Vale of Beaver, of course, in Nottinghamshire. Thank you to Gary and Andy for that one. And I showed him the beaver. <laughs> <laughs> Chris has lost it. <laughs> Chris, you're leaking. Really leaking now. <laughs> oh no. Tom in Hartford's watching. This has made his day at work so much better. Amy is taking a break from sunbathing to watch this. <laughs> What's happening now, please? Chris, why are you? Water, please. Come on. Thomas is ready. We're keeping him. 
that. I showed him the beaver. <laughs> Third time. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, you know what it's like, Chris. You need to sometimes pull yourself together. You all right now? Yeah, fine. Okay. Right, so if you're watching this on YouTube at the moment, on your computer, then you can make sure that you never, ever miss another innuendo bingo again. What you do is click subscribe right here on this picture of our favourite member of the Upper House in Westminster, Lady Garden. There she is. But be quick, because we're going to go back to innuendo bingo any second. Click on Lady Garden, and that means you've subscribed. Done it? Okay, fill your mouths, please. Next clip. Mm. So this is our favourite one from Cheese. <laughs> Chris! I'm so sorry about this, Thomas. You can swallow if you want to say what you really think. I'm absolutely soaked. I know. I mean, seriously, it's gone through my pants. Mm. But anyway. Yeah. Time for the south. <laughs> oh, do I need to... Um, re to tank. Re -tank. Re -tank. Refuel. Refuel. <clears throat> okay. Okay. Yep. So this one was our favourite from Tuesday. Come on, Chris, get it together. Shush. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Shush, I've got to introduce the clip. Seriously. Just get on with it. Right, so this is a, a, a play on Radio 4 Extra. There is something a little bit impertinent about it. <laughs> <laughs> right, now we're just being silly. That's just someone's voice. <laughs> Come on, let's just try and get through this one. There is something a little bit impertinent about it, I think. Watching every moment of their private lives. Oh, you'd soon forget your scruples if you could watch your own little tits getting bigger every day. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah, OK. Mm. OK. I'm so sorry. Water. If you could watch your own little tits getting bigger every day. <laughs> Filming birds in their nest. That's what they're talking about. Over to... <laughs> <laughs> this, is, this, is, this is so good. Okay. Um. Over to Brendan's magical mystery <clears throat> tour now. <coughs> Water, please. <coughs> And here, Brendan is having a lovely time straddling a potter's wheel. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. I know, he's lost it. I'm so sorry, Thomas. Chris, sit down and pull yourself together. Mm -hmm. Here's Brendan at the pottery wheel. Here he is. <laughs> okay, Thomas is waiting. I'm ready. You're not, though. You haven't got water in your mouth. You're going to start playing with the club. <laughs> what? Nothing's happened! <laughs> <laughs> oh. Andrew and Wales. Andrew, why are you retiring? Andrew and so Wales has sorry. had to stop to listen. He can't actually drive while, while doing listen to this. Okay. Are ready? You can't retire halfway through. Here's Brendan. We will start playing with the clay, evenly and round. And then we take care of the rim. <laughs> I'm just going to play it. We will start playing with the clay, evenly and round. And then we take care of the rim. Make sure it's always wet. <laughs> to open it, just get in like this. <laughs> I like how gradual that was, Thomas. Mark emailed that one in to scott.mills at bbc.co.uk. That was a good one. Okay, are you ready, Chris, now? Are you back in play? More water, please. Not, not long now. Next, we go over to ITV's Dinner Date. Now, I don't know about you, but this is definitely my favourite way to, to serve a pork dish. Ready? With any luck, the main course will be one of her favourite things. And Natalie will feel the love with some pork inside her. <laughs> Thomas, you've made a mess of yourself. <laughs> with some pork inside her. 
was gone through my nose. <laughs> Oh, wow. This is a great game today. This is actually happening. Kerry, Kerry from Somerset started watching this, uh, this episode of Hollywood Me during the recap after the advert break and was worried that she'd miss some quality TV. Ready? Mm -hmm. Here we go. Mm -hmm. After a close encounter with a reptile... <laughs> ..going legs akimbo with Stephanie Beecham... Now I need help. And having her chakras realigned with a didgeridoo. <laughs> oh wow! <laughs> this is the best bingo uh, ever. Oh, the the, the studio is flooded. It's all fine. Oh, my shoes are wet as well. <laughs> Frankie, Frankie in Wellingborough said Thomas uh, then. Thomas just had a beautiful water snort. <laughs> yeah, it's gone up my nose. It's even in my ears. Oh, Can it go in your ears or is that something else? How <laughs> <laughs> are you I don't on know. About? Okay, over to Coronation Street now. And Molly here being very honest about how she paid for Jenna to go to uni. Ready? Mm -hmm. Here we go. Mandy's been a bit sniffy about the kind of work Jenna's going on for. And what Lloyd doesn't realise is I'm the one that pulled my tripe out to see her through uni. <laughs> Okay. Mm. Everyone's fine after that one. Mm. But what about this? From EastEnders. Your horoscope said that the moon was in Uranus. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you to Abby and Sean for that predictable. one. Predictable. Oh. It was. <clears throat> okay. And one more. Do you need water? Uh, I've not got any Just water. one more. Oh, uh, uh, go on. Uh, you take it? Uh, oh, go on. Finally, our absolute favourite clip uh. of the last few months from Crime Watch Roadshow and their report on crowd control at pop concerts with a horse that was very busy, this very busy police horse. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. He's been a police horse for about 12, 13 years. He's very busy. We know that he polices pop concerts, huge crowds. What else does he do? Yeah, he was in Rihanna last night. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <wow. laughs> oh. This game is ridiculous. That, that was brilliant. Can you say that again. That was brilliant. <laughs> Thomas, it's really a pleasure to have you on Inuendo yeah, Bingo today. Can say that again. <laughs> Thank you very much. Oh, you are wet. I am. So, oh, so wow. Good. Um, thank you very much for playing. Thank you a lot for listening. And thank you for watching online. This has been Innuendo Bingo. It's back on Tuesday. Thank you, Zoas. <laughs>